Hi, I'm Kristen with Co Arts, and today we will be working on these two 8x10 canvases. We are doing a triptych today on these canvases. These are 8x10s, that's the reason why you guys are so close, because <laughs> they are small canvases, but I wanted to work on them. I wanted to do a triptych, and lately I've been feeling this yin and yang thing um, in regards to black and white, so I wanted to go along with it since that's how I was feeling. Kind of up, down, <laughs> you guys know how it goes. I'd like for you guys to join me and pay attention as we go on another acrylic pouring adventure. I have all of my colors picked out for today. The colors that I have picked out are going to be Silver Anniversary. We have black, we have titanium white, we have a little bit of gray, and we have silver, regular silver. So my two bases are going to be black and white for the yin and the yang, <laughs> or the opposite, light and dark. Um, and that's the theme again that we are going to go with. But before I start, please stop the video right here and go ahead and hit the like button. You guys see it? It's right there. Hit the like button. Make sure that you guys are following me. Make sure that you guys are subscribed to my channel. Also, make sure that your notification bell is turned on so that you can be notified every time I post an art video. Let's go ahead and get started. So again, black and white. Here's my black right here. And black is gonna be on this side. So I told you guys I was gonna have a secret message inside of my videos, the uh, four videos. One, this is number two. So I'm gonna post a secret message. This time it's gonna come in the form of me posting the secret message with this black right here so make sure that you guys are paying attention remember you need all four secret messages in order to be entered to win a free prize from case go arts so here we go and you guys see that <laughs> okay so the secret message as you guys can see not sure if you can see it fully, but I'm gonna turn it around so that you can see. Secret message is love. Let's go ahead and put this back. Then I'm gonna come in on this side and do white. Don't worry, it's no secret message right here. One secret message per video. So I have my white, I have my black, now I am going to go ahead and blow this out with my blow dryer. So here we go. This side with the black is a little bit thicker, <laughs> or at least it's blowing out kind of thick. Let me go ahead and blow out my white now. Okay, so we have our black and our wet white bases done. Just taking some of the paint that has dripped off, filling in my sides as best as possible. Wiping it on my canvas <laughs> uh, apron right here. Okay. Almost done. It's gonna be a pretty quick video. I mean, because they are smaller canvases. So, 
now that I have them filled. Nope, I do not have them filled. This side over here is not filled. So now that I officially have them filled, <laughs> now I can go ahead and proceed with putting on the paint. So what I'm going to do is on this side, the black side, on the black side, I am going to do white right here. And then on the white side, I am going to do Black, of course. And then I'm going to come in with my gray on the black side and my gray on the white side. And then this top is not on correctly. Let's go ahead and put my regular silver. Let me shake this up first. My regular silver, not silver anniversary yet. But let me go ahead and put that on my black side. I don't know why I keep touching the canvas with it. And there's some silver on the white side. And then last color, of course, silver anniversary. First time not adding gold. <laughs> Okay, so silver anniversary coming in there strong on both sides. And just for the heck of it, even though it's on this side, I'm gonna add a little bit of black on top. And then over here, I'm gonna add a little bit of white on top. Then I'm going to take my blowtorch and pop these bubbles on here. Let's roll up these leaves. Okay, so now that we have this done, I can decide whether or not I want to use, because these are such small canvases, whether or not I want to use my blow dryer so that it won't go, you know, everywhere or whether or not I want to use my straw. And as of right now, I'm going to use my straw. Let's make sure there's no paint on here. Okay. So I'm going to use my straw to do this design. So here we go. Okay, so we have our black side blown out. Now let's go ahead and do the white side. And I love it. I love it. Absolutely. Okay, I'm gonna blow this part out right here just a little bit more. Oh no, don't touch the canvas. <laughs> And 
we are done with our opposite white and black. Black and the white, white and the black, gray and silver, silver anniversary pour that we have just created. And guess what? Again, we used our straw <laughs> to be able to do this. So have that done. I absolutely love it. I've never done a painting like this before with the opposite black and white. Now I've done multiple colors, one color right here, one color right there, but the black and the white and the white and the black and the black and the white. <laughs> <laughs> I've never done it that way before. I do see a little spot right here that's kind of different from the rest of it. So let me go ahead and fix that. Yep, this is how I was using. Okay, so now I got it. I wanna bring you guys in for the close-up, so let me go ahead and take you guys in. Come on in. And there we go, with these two eight by 10 canvases side by side, the white, gray, and silver, and silver anniversary in the black, and then the black, silver, gray, and silver anniversary in the white. And this is how it looks as a whole, being eight, two eight by 10 canvases on this triptych. It turned out absolutely amazing. I'm so glad I went ahead and went along with this. This is the idea that I wanted to go with. This is what I've been feeling. Sometimes you're feeling light, sometimes you're feeling dark. This has nothing to do with um, anything religious wise. This has everything to do with sometimes when you are a mother or wife, uh, pediatrician, chauffeur, uh, you have all these roles to fill. Sometimes you have times in which you're feeling light but sometimes that darkness goes into the light and sometimes your light goes into the darkness and that is what I wanted to show in this two-piece 8 by 10 right here you guys taking you in for the close-up very very close I love the way that this turned out I love it you guys well, I would like to thank you guys so much for joining me on another acrylic pouring adventure with the black and the white. Thank you guys so much. Please make sure that you're subscribed to my YouTube channel. Please make sure you are following me on all social media platforms. As I always say before I sign out, number one, stay safe. Number two, stay blessed. And number three, no matter what it is in this world or your world that you are personally facing, decide and turn your pain into paintings. Thank you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye!